Good afternoon, everyone. So, after you've been wondering for hours what I've had to think of the re news of Bob Iger returning to the Walt Disney Company, here are my thoughts. Mr. Iger, sir, I am truly not... I'm truly surprised that you just chose to come back after you've promised you'd retire. And... But it makes sense for you to return have, knowing that Disney needs to rebound back to a good state now that they're out of the pandemic, thanks to Chapix, um at least risks that he took, financially speaking. That being said, I do have some concerns of what you might reverse that I don't want you to reverse when you return at Disney. So let me go through what those three things are. Um, the first thing is I hope that you continue to allow for more LGBTQ representation in upcoming Disney films like Pixar, like uh, Disney Animation Studios' next two films, Strange World and next year's uh, Wish, the big 100th anniversary film for Disney, since there are characters of LGBTQ um, uh, sexuality and non-binary uh, uh, sexuality in those two films, especially to prove that you will not no longer kowtow to China or Russia as you've been known to do in the past, and especially in light of the tragic um, shooting in Colorado Springs that happened this past Saturday. Um, number two, since people are really begging Disney and are hopefully excited for the return of hand-drawn animation at Disney Animation Studios, I hope that you can ensure that this translates to letting Tiana, the upcoming sequel series to The Princess and the Frog hitting Disney Plus in 2024, be hand-drawn animated as well, since it would really be a big deal for the 15th anniversary of Princess and the Frog, especially with Splash Mountain being replaced by Tiana's Bayou Adventure in Disney Parks. And finally, Bob Chapek knew that Disney Plus and Disney needed more adult content in the U.S. and more general entertainment, so I hope that you ignore the analysts who are telling you to go back to the family-friendly, safe uh, um, uh, space and that you will ensure the 18-episode Daredevil Born Again series for Disney Plus for Marvel Studios coming in 2024 will be shot in New York and Practical and rated TVMA and Deadpool 3 in November 2024 be R-rated as well. That's all. Thank you.